So yo, fix the focus on your camera. Well, friends, I kind of, kind of how I put it in manual. We're gonna see if it's actually focused. I can't tell by that little screen, and it looks really bright. But I don't know if it's because of the brightness of the camera. But we're on Need for Speed 2015 today. As you can see, we've got the beautiful skyline in here. And we're on the PlayStation 4 version. Yes, my new flat setup means that I can get this glitch working on console. And it's absolutely fucking glorious. I've, all I've done on this so far is actually removed the hood and the front bumper. And I think it looks absolutely freaking mean. A lot of people notice it and go, oh, that looks pretty damn nice. So I'm actually going to keep it on the skyline. And now one thing I did try yesterday, just before doing a... Uh, a speed list because this works in the speed list lobby loading thing as well which freezes the timer for a second remove the front bumper of this thing and it looks really freaking weird so today what did i want to do why am i on this game again well i wanted to do the glitch on another car now as you know there's two versions of this thing that you can do you can basically add parts onto cars with body kits on or you can remove parts from a car and what we're going to do today is remove literally everything from one car and see how it turns out. I may be slightly wrong here, but my my mindset is that the cars with two most customization will probably be the 180SX and the Supra. Where is the Supra? I've probably gone past, yeah, the Supra. So the Supra, I think, has an advantage changing the rear lights, but that's it. But the point is we need two different cars anyway. So we're gonna use the Supra as the donor car so we can take parts off of a 180SX. I really want a 180SX. I want to try and keep the pop-up headlights on the car, but the rest of the body is gone. Let's see how that turns out. You actually remove the wing. You can remove the wing. So you can just remove the wing straight out. But yeah, as you can see, this thing has a lot of customizations that you can do to the car. The only thing you can't really change is the rear lights. I think that's literally it. Just, just the rear lights. So yeah, the Supra is definitely going to help us with that. But other than that, we have everything on the trunk lids. We can't do that. Now, if you want a tutorial on how to do this glitch yourself, I will link the video in the description below and I made a little tutorial on how to do it. But in this video, I'm basically going to skip through it and just do the process anyway and have fun with it. But yeah, what I need to do is unplug the ethernet cable from my switch that plugs into my router. That, that cable, that ethernet cable, not the console cable, otherwise it'll just kick you off. And then basically plug it back in straight away, quickly do it because I have a time limit on consoles when the router reconnects and starts working properly again. But yeah, if I leave it out, it'll kick me off. But let's do it! Unplug cable, plug it back in shit. It's probably gonna kick me off. I took it out too, for too long there. But go on the car, go on the customization. Oh fuck, I was too slow! You know, you know what? You know what? Fuck this chair. I don't need this chair. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna sit on the floor. I'll move my mic down so I can speak to yourself. <laughs> back on the 180, go on the Supra. Unplug, plug back in. Quick, go on the Supra, go on the Supra. Quick, 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 quick. And we got a front bumper. Get off. Go on, get off. Yes. Oh, the wrong car. Shit. This time, this time, this time. Shit, what am I doing? Oh, you're not. Here we go, here we go. Front bumper has gone. Look at those pop-up headlights now. Can you see me? I don't know. I just stood on my headphone cable. Get that hood off. Get it off. Look at that beast. Yes, we're getting there. This thing looks really weird. Off goes the fender. Very nice. It's looking really awesome. I'm going to get up so you can actually see. Look at it. It's beautiful. So the plan is anyway, as I was saying, to keep to get everything off. I've got the fenders off the hood and the front bumper so far. Keep the lights. So what is what we've got next left is obviously the uh, the wing mirrors. We've got ourselves the side skirts. We've got ourselves the rear fenders, rear canards, rear exhaust and bumpers. We've got a lot of stuff to go through. So I'm going to go through all that right now. There we are. That has pretty much removed everything I want to remove using the Supra anyway. There's only one extra thing we can remove on this car, which would be the trunk lid. So I'm actually want to I want to see what that looks like removing the trunk lid. So we need to get a car that actually has a customizable trunk lid. So we need to sell the Supra and find another one. Something's telling me that the GT86 actually has one. I think it does. I think it's like an extra type of wing choice in this car. So let's have a look around this. Spoiler: trunk lid. Yes, we can customize the trunk lid there. So what we need to do is. Wait, wait, that's a stock one. Okay, that's really weird. I didn't, I didn't realize that. There's actually a D-badge option. So this is the car we're going to use for this. So now we need to go back again and do it properly. Quick, 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 quick. Where is it? Trunk lid. Oh my god! It removes the trunk lid. Okay, let's buy that. Yes! Look at it! So do we lower the car or keep it raised? Honestly, I think we keep it raised and maybe rake it a little bit. Yeah, let's rake it and uh, let's bring the wheels out. <laughs> 
and put camber on them. Let's have a look how the trending wraps suit our beautiful car. So we've got a Suicide Squad one, which is, I don't know. Some of these might fit really well, actually, like a broken race car almost. Have a look around. Come on, change it. There we go. We've got a, I don't know. I think we need a bright color to make it go like, yeah, whip, it's broken. Oh, wait a second. Yes, the rust mobile. See, I would love that, but at the same time, I kind of want color. Mm. Some of these wraps actually look really, really good. But what I'm gonna do is, I'm actually, no, wait, we could we could go with that and make the background pink, because I'm guessing the background is green. This is the wrap I gotta go with, and we need to change those wheels a little bit to change them to make them stand out, so let's do that next. And there's the final result. We got ourselves the 180SX with pink outlines on the rims and gold rims. I think this is gonna be absolutely beautiful, so let's take this outside now and see <laughs> what pictures we can get. I don't know. <laughs> it's just so weird looking. Remember this thing is actually stock. I don't even have NOS. Oh my god, what the hell. Let's go Let's go follow that fella and see what he thinks. Why are you going round in circles? I'm trying to be your friend. Please, wait for me. Come on, please. Don't go in the garage. Stay outside the garage and wait there. Wait there. Don't you dare. You not! Something tells me the passengers are going to get wet from driving in my whip. Yes. <laughs> so... Yeah, this is this is uh this is what most people will be driving around in on Need for Speed in the very near future. You you play oh he's there, he's there. Come on, say hello to me, mate. Come on. Have a look at my car. Look at me. Yes? Do you like it? No, you're just gonna ignore the fact that my car is fucking broken. Alright, fuck you then. Please, let's be friends! Be my friend! Hello, do you like my car? <laughs> I think he's realized now that my car is fucking broken. Do you like it, yeah? <laughs> do you want to race me? Let's let's have a race. Come on. Uh, let's, let's do this one. I don't know what I press actually. Come on, challenge me! I dare ya! Do you like my whip? Yes? Eh? Do you like my my whip? I wish I could like control the pop-up headlights. That would be awesome. Like, no, no, stop showing off and fucking appreciate my car. You're not doing very well, are you? Anyway, I just wanted to do a quick video absolutely destroying a car because that's not something I've done. I don't think I've seen anyone else do it just yet on Need for Speed. So. What I may possibly do in the next video, if I want, if I do another video on this glitch, it will actually be putting parts on a car that normally weren't. So if I get an Evo, for example, put the body kit on and then try and put some bumpers and stuff on as well, I think that would be pretty awesome. Anyway, let me know what you want me to do in the next video on Need for Speed 2015. Be sure to leave a like if you want to see more Need for Speed 2015 videos. I'm probably going to start bringing a few more out, just random things, and also normal actual race gameplay because I miss it. Anyway. Be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you are new, and we'll see you guys in the next video. I am never selling this car. If I sell this car, somebody can have a go at me, and I'll, I'll do a, a horrible challenge or something. Nice.